Uh, we're going to look at the Grand Lodge. Uh, this is a 42 FK. 42 FK. Yeah, it's an incredible unit, and we have a special one coming up for you. And real quick, if you would, Austin, just pan over that direction. Just show a quick preview. Uh, somebody asked for a workspace for two people with computers. We're going to show it to you here in just a little bit. Uh, so that that's an exciting one coming up. Also, this one's incredible. You can live in this thing. We got a 42 or 44 view coming up as well. But uh, Dalton, take us through this one if you would. So, like you said, 2023 Wildwood Grand Lodge 42 FK. Uh, you're at 42 feet 11 inches, so 43 feet uh, roughly. Uh, 12,500 pounds. Um, you got two slides on this side, two slides on the opposing side there, front kitchen. Um, awesome little setup here. If you're an Ohio State fan and you want to put an outside TV out here and watch Ohio State beat Michigan this year, because we're two out of three it's, it's years. It's happening. Yeah, it's happening this year. We're due. Um, outside speakers, TV hookup out here. But of course, the main attraction is on the inside here. So let's get inside and check out this camper. Okay, Kelly just asked, what if I'm interested in one of these trailers today, but I can't get to one of your stores until this weekend? Can I still get that price? Kelly, what we can do, if you call, talk to one of our salespeople, we can ask the factory, now this will sound crazy, but basically for a writer or an exception for you, and we can get the factory's permission to extend everything through this weekend. We just put a date on it, and they should be all right with that. But what you want to do is call and talk to Dalton or call and talk to Mitch. Um, both of them will take great care of you. You may see some other guys or, or girls as the day goes on. But, yeah, call in. Tell them which unit you want. We'll get it reserved and, and get that discount reserved for you. So officially this camper sleeps six, unofficially it sleeps eight. Uh, here we are in the main living space. So you do have a couple of recliners here. Uh, just pull your little drawstring. Of course, you're nice and relaxed in front of your TV. This is awesome. It is. Look at all the seating space. It's crazy. Uh, but of course, like I said, unofficially it sleeps six. You do have uh, two little fold-out couches opposing each other here. Folds all the way out into two queen beds, uh, one on each side there. So that way if you want to, your kids want to bring anybody else with you while you're sleeping or just uh, some extra... Nice People fireplace you? too. Yep. Nice fireplace directly uh, below your outside or your speaker that controls your inside and outside speakers. Uh, beautiful TV that comes with you. And of course, uh, your loft up here that you can see gives you direct access to your kids make sure you're sleeping. I'll tell you, camp. the kids love those lofts too because it's it's like their bedroom is a, a, a play area. You know what I mean? They, well, they just, they love them. It is. Well, and the other thing too is if you are, uh, say you don't have kids or grandkids or anything like that, you can use it for storage space yeah, or anything I was like just that. Gonna say we have a lot of customers that take the, the Rubbermaid tubs yep. and and put them up there for storage because you never have enough storage when you, when you live in something like this, especially. And a lot of our customers are living in them. Yep. The other thing too, if you guys notice, lots of windows all the way around. So lots of viewing space. So if you're on a permanent spot with a, a lake around you or anything like that, you can look out every morning and see the beautiful lake around you. Um, the but kitchen if, is incredible. It is. Uh, front kitchen in this camper, solid surface countertops all the way around. Uh, beautiful double basin uh, stainless steel sink here. Uh, awesome cabinetry all the way through. Uh, uh, the name of the cabinetry, I think, is Capri. Um, awesome microwave another, here. Another big window up there, too. Yeah. Um, awesome windows all the way through. Good catch there, David. Yeah, that's, yeah. A, that's a huge. And big side-by-side -side yep. residential I think it's reefer. Bigger than the one I have at home. I'm not going to undo there. that so that way who the next owner can get it nice and fresh. Now how impressive is that? Yep. That way you can, I, I like to burn my grilled cheese and tomato soup, so that's where I keep all the cans of tomato <laughs> soup in there. <laughs> no, but you know, someone asked earlier, uh, I think it was Chris, but I'm not sure, I apologize. Do we have any units you can live in? The, here's one you can absolutely live in. A lot of folks are living in these, yep. but they're living in smaller ones as well. But this one is, is really set up for the comforts at home. Mm -hmm. we got I, about two minutes. I have uh, people that buy these and put them on land and live on them while they're building their house. Awesome little dinette here that you can remove that and put in your own set, set up if you'd like, but awesome little dinette. Uh, let's move on back to the bathroom here. Cause yeah, Mary wants to see the, the uh, master suite. Yeah, absolutely. We'll hit the bathroom on the way back first. Awesome little shower there. Still solid surface countertops on your sink. Porcelain toilet, of course. If you do order these, you can't have it removed, uh, all the uh, tanks and everything removed. And of course, here's the lofts. Oh, I'll crawl up into this side here. And as you can see, lots of space for your kids or storage or anything. 
it is. And of course, the master suite here in the back of the camper, full-size queen bed with lots of storage underneath as well. Access to the outside, of course. You do have a wardrobe here with a couple of mirrors. And of course, washer dryer hookup here. So that way while you have a permanent setup, you can do all your laundry as well. Carrie wants to know if this one comes with the automatic vac system. It does. It does have the automatic vacuum system. So um, one thing that was underneath the bedroom was, or underneath the bed there was all the hoses and everything for it. So you can hook it up right here and uh, sweep everything basically to there. And then once you're hooked up, just lift this exactly with your foot. It looks like it doesn't want to kick on. Oh, I don't have the switch on. And then it automatically backs. Push that back down. I'll just turn it off manually. But, yep. And again, what's the price of this unit? It's on the screen, but... It should be on the screen directly below. Uh, guys, you're going to love this thing. Uh, absolutely incredible. Tons of space for you and the family. Or if you're looking for somewhere to live, uh, tons of space. 